The ESPN.com has ranked them the top 25 players under the age of 25. And I want to show you guys how they stacked their top five. Giannis was their number one. Anthony Davis came in second. Joel Embiid was third. Cat and the Joker rounded out the top five. And first off, can we just remark on how quickly things change in this league? We are now perhaps in the middle of the greatest guard era in the NBA. Mm -hmm. And now all of a sudden, all these young up and cuppers are super, super, superstars. Those tomorrow. are fours and fives, all of them. And no guards. And not only that, but I think they still are reflective of where the NBA is going. Look at all those guys. Yeah, yeah. They're all very. But it's just, you wouldn't have, you yeah, would not have thought not if I told position, you three yeah. years ago when Steph's setting the threes record and all that stuff, yep. I said, oh, when we do in three years, our next bud of superstars, there's going to be no guards in it. Yeah. <laughs> no, it would have been Look, insane. Do you guys good with Giannis over AD? Now, I mean, I don't want to be a prisoner of the moment because, I mean, obviously, AD the last month has just been insane. Uh, I mean, I still like, I mean, do I have to choose? Do I really have to choose? I have to choose. I mean, look, I, I think, I think there's, a, there's a certain intensity to Giannis that I just, that smells like superstar to me. Mm -hmm. um, in a way, they're both superstars. I'm kidding, but the sound smells like greatness. Um, and, but what Davis has done in the last month is giving me, again, I, not that I'm ever a prisoner of the moment, but, man, it's hard not to have a little recency bias when you saw what we right. did last night across the street. Well, he's showing you what he's capable of. Well, right? this, this is where I'll, I'll I'm not going to go smell test like Kevin. I'm going to go something a lot more tangible. Of those guys, those five guys, probably the most durable guy is Giannis Antetokounmpo. Yeah. Uh. And, and that's, that's where I'm going with that. If you're asking for a differentiator why he's won over AD, over Embiid, both guys who are otherworldly talents, guys who we, we, I think, in 20 years or so, we'll be seeing them in sure. Springfield. But Giannis hasn't gotten hurt like those other guys have. It's so true. Durability and is, that's, that's is kind of the magic potion. Yeah. Right. That's what separates, you know, LeBron from you know right. guys who might have had every, I mean, you know, many of our friends and on the show talent. here. Yeah. yeah.